call it trash, I'd call it what, organic matter? Mast accomplished, you're from Michigan too. Man, we're get, we got the Michigan squad. It's so nice in Michigan right now. It's so nice in Michigan. It's it's good it's good to be able to say that, you know? Well Dan, I live in Antarctica, that's not very nice to say. Well You firm a band. Alright, we got a goal here. We got, it's a it's a little three for three challenge today. We got we we're going nothing but good wood right now. Number one. Number two, we gotta mark three tanks. Michigan and Ohio, like ninety percent chat i i would heavily debate that i would be willing to say close to half majority of the community is from the uk and surrounding regions prop bet yeah let's go prop bet will we get a key from a, the jacket we're about to loot in the next building will we get a key what? Crimson Wolf, thanks for the long-term 31 months of support, man. I appreciate it. Holy it's a long burn. time. Thank you. I, um... There's like a distant... Uh, this happened last week. Like a distant relative. Not really relative, but like... How can I describe it? Like... Cousin-in-law's sister's kid. Like, so someone I'd never, maybe met once before, but like reached out and was like, hey, like I want to talk to you about streaming. And why did we get to this conversation? Oh, because of 31 months of Crimson Wolf. He's like, like, hey, I'm, I'm in college. I'm, I'm doing game design and I think I want to do that. I kind of want to stream too. And so like, I, you know, I talked to him for a while. And uh, just try to help the best I can. But I don't know why Crimson Wolf subbing for 31 months proc this story, but it did. Hold on. Let's sweep and clear, Sips. Sweep, Sips. Sweep and clear. Um, it's like, hey, yeah, I don't know what I should do. You know, I, I, I think I want to do all these things. And so I told him. I said, hey, look, no one really knows what they want to do. It's kind of just process of elimination. So I'm like, so, I'm like, so do you want to stream? He's like, yeah. I'm like, well, what's preventing you from streaming? He's like, well, nothing. I'm like, well, you know, I got, I got all my homework done for the day. He's like, well, I was going to relax. I'm like, well, let's try streaming today. And then you may not even like streaming, you know, and then he's like, oh, well, then I can just work on game design. So, but then I told him, I don't know what I told him. Like, you guys know me. We're still figuring stuff out. Always figuring stuff out. Um, it just takes a while, and so we're gonna see like sometimes like we need to see if we pull a key here for the prop at like Crimson Wolf subbing for thirty one months like that's no key. Also, we're having two conversations crossing over at the same time. Um, the like Crimson Wolf are subbing for thirty one months. That's a long time, you know. But then you, like sometimes you also forget like we've been streaming that long and longer I could get three tips someone to start streaming would be start just start streaming so and so we were dude so NBA top shot I was really really I'm gonna just preface it I really wanted to open it as like a major pack on Friday so the way Top Shot works, it's like anything else online. Like you enter a queue, they give you a number. There's X amount of packs. So the, I think there was like 65,000 packs they sold yesterday. And we were like number 62,000 in the queue. So I'm like... And we've tried to get in like seven or eight queues and we've never even had a shot. So we had a really, really great shot. I mean, we like get almost a guaranteed pack. So I set everything up and then I had to go like the queue takes hours. So like once you're in, it takes a couple hours to like have your turn in line by the pack. So I'm like, I had to go, but I left everything set up and I'm like, Hey, to, to my wife, I'm like, Hey, this is gonna, this is gonna go off. Can you please buy it? And she's like, yeah, of course. So 
you know, but it's also like, it's not the most straightforward process in the world either. So I left and came back and I'm like, hey, did you buy the pack? She's like, yeah, I think so. But it told me I had to wait for an email. And I was like, bruh. So long story short, we didn't get the pack. I, I didn't sign into the account when I was in the queue. So we missed it, but there'll be another one. I definitely was disappointed, but you know, 90 seconds later, you get over it. Have you seen chocolate chips on the Chuck E. Cheese plate TikTok? I have not. What is it? Hi, TR the packs. They're just hard to get. They're very hard to get. It's like an actual queue system. I guess they're not. They're not like unlike any other packs. The only difference is that I don't want to say it's price controlled, but if we want to buy packs in real life, like they're not price controlled, meaning that like, you know, you're going to pay a markup and this there's only a limited amount, but at a fixed price, if that makes sense. These are digital packs. Yeah, so they only do drops, right? So, like, I think there's, like, maybe a drop a week or something. Maybe two. Don't forget to mark the tank by the tunnel extract. Got it. Thank you. Who said that? Enigma, thank you. Let's go do that right now. Part-time Dreadlord. You... Do you... Honest opinion at me in your response. Do you think when we open this is not memes? I, I'm interested in your opinion. Do you think when we open up real life packs without gloves, do you think that ruins the cards? You know what? I want everyone to why in chat for yes and in chat for no. Let's go. Shemp, thanks for the five months, says yes. All right, so we're marking three tanks. 92% say no. I got you. That's why you got a PSA 8 TBH. You found a band. That's way too soon, man. That's way too soon. That's a... T that's... That's a touchy subject. Wow. That's... That one, that one hurt. That hurt a lot. I could, I'm, I'm still stinging from that. And you know what? You guys know I'm, I'm pretty, I'm pretty easy, right? Like you lob something at me, I'll just bounces off not a big deal you can roll with the punches but man when you send when you send in cards to PSA to get graded and I'm not gonna talk about the good old days two years ago you send them in at a at a cost 45 days they turn around grade it back now it takes like six to nine months if you're lucky at a higher price and you come back and they're all PSA 8s, no PSA 10s. Bruh. <laughs> it's fun though, it's a learn. Everything changes, man. That's why, like. Ooh, what happened here? Everything changes. And that's why I don't like. So basically, I mean, this happened for like a month ago. We got a bunch of cards back from PSA and I opened them up on Instagram. And uh, I don't think we have one PSA 10, which is really what you want. You think that was a hundred meter shot, dude? That that guy that guy took that guy got so much good gear from that. He's probably doing shooter born in heaven, huh? That's great, man, dude. Where do you think he was? That's a great. I mean, it's a great setup. 
That's a, what a great setup. I can't even like, like that's what that's what we probably made th that individual's day. On the rock wall extract, real ch so to the left of us. Yeah, I was looking for that Xenoblade song. Like, see, we can we can we can deal with getting he head eyes with like tremendous gear on our first raid of the day. Don't you talk about our PSA eights? Uh, I I don't know what number song that was. I really liked our gear set too, man. We had a really good gear set. That's all right. We didn't lose these markers. You have a buddy you can get on sniper scav rock. That we had some good gear. We got we got to get over that. It's it's time to move forward. Um I hate to like bring not good gear. You know what I mean? Especially because we have some money, but you know what? Let's just, let's re-up. Dunky de dunky de dunky. Maybe we have some good stuff from Prapper. Do you PSA grade digital cards? No, that's a good question. You don't. You don't. Um, we don't have any insurance, huh? Man, how do we get in all this money? It's it's a good problem to have for sure. Chat, you guys make the call. M. Ooh. Out of stock? I think we're going to do an MP5 run. What's the market like for digital cards? I don't know. I, I don't know. Um, I'm not educated on that. But I think it's cool. So I want to... At least try and get involved at the beginning for a little bit. All right. Well, you know, if we have money, why, why, why go stingy? If we have money, don't be stingy. Man, everything's sold out. Is it? Is it like? Is it high time in Tarkov right now? You could use the HK. Right. I just I just don't want to use bad gear. Let's not use bad. Then don't use bad gear, Dan. Let's, we don't have to get super egregious, but let's uh Bob, look. I will say this, Ryan Gary's got a point, man, that if there was a YOLO button in Tarkov, we'd be the fastest runner in the Midwest. Let's go ahead. So let's buy a decent backpack here. Do we have ears? I don't know if we have ears. Let's buy ears. We have an Erlac or somewhere. Uh... Let's bring this in, but without the hesitant on that. But you know what? We've got to kill with it, so let's let's quickly get buy one of these, buy one of those. We'll run it back. We'll run it back. Thank you guys for your patience. Slap one of those on there. Well, this that guy had the good ammo. Uh, we'll buy two. We'll buy two ice cream cones for it. I'm I'm not a I'm not opposed Welcome to brand new subscriber. To buying a couple mags. And how are those so cheap? There we go. Okay, let's load these up. I know people don't like the BT ammo. That's 
expensive, but you know what? Scared money. BS. BS. Twin. Charge. Did we buy it? I thought we bought a charging handle. No. We got one. Okay. Thank you guys for your patience. Um, Little short on Medici. Bring one of these. Bring one of those. Couple nades. And that guy. We got to just got to be a little more smart. We got to we got to be aware. To your credit though, we we did have like four conversations, so I'm okay with that. Let's good good go. good goody goody goody. Thank you guys for your patience. It's not it's not it's part of the process. Sometimes you take some L's. All right, now we can catch up. Insured, we're going in. Be a little bit smarter than we were before. All right. Thank you guys for your patience. That's that's early. That's early to get wiped like that, but that's okay. It happens. Yo, show steak oh fish. Thanks for the four months. I'm Shemp. Thanks for the five. Mionia, thanks for the ten. Mr. Karapika, my pleasure. Thanks for the 19 months. Scrotty one one nine. Holy 64 bird. months. Okay, look. No judgment zone. 64 months is a derivative of 12, which would be. It is not a derivative of 12. It's 5.4 years. Thank you for the five years of support. What is that icon? Grady, can you say something in chat? What color is that icon? I mean, it's, it's rare that someone rolls up five years deep. Yo, Double D, thanks for being here. Seranthio, brand new subscriber, 100% invented Dynamix Studios. Thanks for the Prime Reno and Sean89. Thanks for the four months of Prime. Yo, speaking of that, so I found an old Reddit. Well, not a Reddit. I found a Reddit that um, is. Remember we talked about the old game, The Realm, the first MMO I ever played. It was basically that publisher, Sierra. It was like they put, produced all these great adventure games i found there's like just a reddit for fans of sierra games and then someone posted last week hey does anyone remember sierra's the realm and then there was like someone that posted like yeah, yeah i used to play this is my character name and i was like Dude, what? i knew that guy he, he had he had the light blue thing on he was like a a gm he was sometimes kind of mean but i remembered him and it's like man you can connect with someone from 20 plus years ago on the internet based on their fake name on a social site that's segmented down to the publisher of the video game that's crazy i mean like i wouldn't consider him like he wasn't like he was like one of the people in game that was promoted to like a uh i guess the best way to put it it's not a fair way to put it but like a moderator but like Did you guys hear that conversation? Did you hear that? <laughs> like, <laughs> there's, there's some some dude knocking on the window. <laughs> like, you don't knock on the window. <laughs> Anyways, um, it was it would be like a player who was elevated to like. Cool. Not a moderator. Because moderators are cool. Like, um. Like. Hall monitor. That got to wear like a teacher's badge. You know? So, like, you know, when that person walked in the server, everyone's like, okay. Or we walked by wearing like the light blue thing. Everyone's like, oh, that's so cool but also they let you know how cool they were. 
kind of like a game guide, but more of just like if someone was acting out of line, they would come in and like bop them. But they most oh I, I can't even say that most of them were cool. This this one individual, like he just made he made sure that you knew he was a GM. I think that's probably the best way to put it, you know. But the best GMs were the ones who were just like. It wasn't even a big deal. They were just like, yeah, I just really like the game. Um, but it was still cool to like, be like, oh, I remember that. I mean, look, as a 12 year old playing the game, I wanted one of those light blue things. But of course, you know, this is no disrespect to any 12 year olds watching. Like you don't have the maturity to, well, I didn't have the maturity to, help a community when I was 12 years old, you know, <laughs> I just wanted it because it looked cool. That's prob honestly, that's probably one of the, the first cosmetic item in game that I ever wanted of any game for sure. Most adults do, don't either. No, and that's not fair to say because I'm sure there are some, I'm sure there's some 12 and 13 year olds that are able to do that. I definitely was not able to. Uh, let's go get this tank first. Thanks, Cedar. Can you can you copy that? I'm gonna ask it again, probably. I wasn't like. It, it really it sparked a lot of memories. I, I like. I didn't drop so. On the Reddit post, I didn't drop my character name. I dropped two of the guys that I used to, like, play with. And they were, you know, I, I don't really, I remember one of their, their real life names, but I didn't put those in there. Um, I'm like, oh, do you remember these two guys? And those two guys that I played with, like they would always push the limits, you know? Like, they wouldn't, trolling it was in it, but like if there was like an edge, they'd walk right up to the edge. You know, you have to remember. And all, like, the come full circle. All that stuff stems from the sacred text right here. The email text. Anyways. Because there wasn't much to do in the game. It was just... You just kind of... So sometimes you had to make your own fun. And games have come a long way. You used to just stand in a room and talk. And sometimes fight an enemy that was the equivalent of just rolling dice. It's crazy. I was called the realm. Sierra's the realm. I will say though. It's a dangerous spot. The first thing that guy brought up in the Reddit post was those respawning gold pants that everyone would rush to. They'd spawn every 30 minutes. And you could only get it if you had a good internet connection. Alright. Early MMO culture, now we have dailies. I never played Dragon Fable, no. I've heard of Neverwinter Nights. I think that was through AOL, though, back in the day. Alright. Now, the question... So, we have a quest to do. But should we go loot? Of course we should. Before it was gold pants, today it's graphics cards. I mean, the gold pants were slick, though. But sometimes I like, you know, you think back to stuff, like how it shaped what you like. 100%. So there was like, that was, that was the first online loot. So basically it would spawn every 30 minutes. There couldn't be any players on the screen for it to actually spawn. 
and there was a chest. So you came in from the right side of the, the screen and the chest was on the left side. And so people would just walk back and forth, right to left, right to left, right to left. And then when it spawned, the chest would be closed. So you would know, like, so you walk right, right, left, right, left. It would spawn, you would know. And then it was just a mad dash to get over there, right click it open, click open. And then right click, I think it said pick up. That was the, f so I look at that. Like I never thought about it like this. So it was gold pants that you couldn't buy in the game. And there was 5,000 gold inside the pants. So that's like the first online loot. And then it's cosmetics on top of that. But like if you saw someone walking around with gold pants, you're like, how did they get those gold pants? And thus the lore started to build Ooh. of the rare loot, man. That's crazy. Like, I wonder if that wasn't in, wasn't like in my first online game experience. Maybe we wouldn't care about loot. You know what I mean? Yeah, we're live. We we will not be not live for a very long time. No, we're we're good for a while. Yeah, and they were gold pants. They were called pants of holding. But that's what the guy who I was talking to on Reddit about. That's what he remembered. Heck, <laughs> man. Crazy. Dude, I remember doing it so much too. And like, you'd get beat, you'd get beat, you wouldn't get the pants. And then the one time you get the pants, man. Not only did you get the pants, so you'd get the pants of holding. Then everyone else would be around wondering who got the pants. And then all of a sudden you would just see one person's avatar. Their pants would change to gold pants, man. <laughs> it's so good. It was so good. So you didn't even have to ask, you knew. And then you would right click the person to see what their name was. After I got the pants, did I try to get them again? Well, there's 5,000 gold inside. So I, I did, but it wasn't as like, you know, I, I knew to let other people kind of have their chance. Do anyone else have like a memory of that? Like their but see it all be like, well, I was playing uh, Halo, and some guy was swearing at me. Like I, I just feel very lucky that I, you know I had a very like pre-internet experience. It was just good, man. It was good. Good. All right, let's get this quest in. We're, we'll try. We're gonna try that game, man. First ever rune chess piece in RuneScape. Was it? It was it like rare. Your first land party. Yeah, you remember that stuff. Toxicity was part of the fun of Halo. Hey, to each their own. No judgment zone. Used to go to the arcades to play Street Fighter and Tekken. Were you one of those those guys? Were you one of those players that was like really good and just waited for the other people to come in, put their quarters in, and be like, "Thank you for paying for my game." Let's um Let's prop at this key right now. Well, we won't know, never mind. I just want to use it. DDR was your arcade game? I always wondered how people got good at DDR since like back then like you couldn't really own it.
scab underneath us. Where's that hole in the floor? I don't know for sure, so let's not be egregious. Oh, I just saw a Ninja Turtle run right to left there. There's, we got a two front war going now. Think that's at us? Confused. That's a better Chandler. Let's take it. Yeah. I would have liked to gone after that Ninja Turtle, but probably too late, huh? I think it's too late. Let's, um, let's tippy Hendren here for a second. And we got off on a, we're already off. Take the Tarzan for extra space in the backpack. We could have run to 301 and taken shots from there. Uh -huh. Remember the first time you had a bunch of friends linked up four Xboxes and TVs. That's cool that they did that, you know? That they made that system like that check the key we're thinking about saving it for a prop bet i never i never used or had an xbox but oh come on playing that a guy yep that was a guy I'm like, it's either a guy or a bunch of garbage bags. It was a guy. Our instincts are on. We just got to execute now. <laughs> oh, that was probably him too. Yeah, we can still prop at the key. I thought it was like a pile of garbage bags. I'm like, but that was probably the turtle too. We could have had him. All right, we're okay. Sometimes you gotta take some L's. Didn't it look like a pile of garbage. I didn't know. No turtle uses BT ammo. Yeah, yeah, Fury. It's a static key spawn though. Is it? I've never seen that before. Have I ever played Rogue Glitch? Is it new? I have not. All right, let's, uh, does that mark still count? It does. Okay. Seems like our type of game. All right, we're gonna go, um, we're not gonna go budget build here. What's it about? What's Rogue Glitch about? I don't know why we didn't shoot that guy. I wish I, I wish I had an answer for you. I don't. Check the 338 ammo price. Rogue Light Platformer. Yo, KS, 
Is it because of uh, time stuff? All right. So we want us to check the TAC X. 820 around. Um, life's too short to use bad gear. So let's buy some matching matching. All right, let's go. This buy, buy some complex. One thing, what gun should we use here? Should we use, I kind of want to use the MP5. It's been a minute. Ooh. Should we use MP5? Donkey Dunk. Let's go MP5. Our stuff's getting a little out of hand here, but that's okay. It's, it's... Eat this. Save some space, bring some hemostat, bring this with us. We're all of a sudden, we're back in this. Throw the monies in there. All right, we're gonna check the key here. Ladies and gentlemen, is this a $100,000 key or more? <gasps> What's in there? Hey, Team Red. West Wing 216. We already had one? No. Never mind. <laughs> Red card or lead X? <laughs> Possible lead X spawn, okay. Let's make this nice. Let's make that look. Did we earn this? No, of course not, but we're still gonna make it nice. Little red laser is city. By red, it. <gasps> Four? I didn't know that was possible. I mean, if you're going to make it four, where is it? You might as well make it five. <laughs> All right. No traders, though. The traders won't sell us four. Do we have to buy? Yeah. Six with the helmet. All right. One of these days. One of these days, chat. We'll have it set up so it'll build for us. Okay. Um. That's kind of a. It really was fairly inexpensive too. Seventy G's. Look at that thing. That was worth the price of admission. I can promise you that. All right. How do we keep a clean stash? It's, I, I'm not sure I'm qualified to give that intel anymore. We want to go AP for sure. Hang in here. We should probably buy one more of these, huh? Press the sort button. All right. I just don't know if that's enough ammo, but it's gonna have to work for us. I feel like, why in chat? Why in chat if you have confidence on this run and in chat if no? Bring 300 rounds at least. I mean, that's assuming we're going to get to battle. As long as if we can get to battle, I'll buy another 60.
Okay, bring this in our back pocket. We gotta finish this raid. Let's finish this raid. Um, we have G hills. No, we do. Okay. Okay, thank you guys for your patience. Couple nades here. We'll be good to go. How about a win, man? How about a win? If you want to win, put the MP5 in. Okay, donkey, donkey, donkey. Good news is we should have a lot of insurance coming back today. Okay, thank you guys for your patience. Um, hey, Dan, did you ever finish Alt F4? Are you still in that last little bit? We're going to finish it today. I'm feeling confident. The sword button should be a 5.96 million channel reward point. Sort the entire inventory. MP5, perfect for long ranges on shoreline. Windstalker, you know what? We got, we got to play, we got to play OKG our kind of game. We got to get close range. I did not say that during Clubhouse games. Can I change your streaming hours to be whenever I am free? Yes. If you go to dangeasing, youtube.com slash plays, you can watch the VODs whenever you'd like. But I, don't you feel like a, a stash sort would be, would it help or hurt production value? But I, you know, tired turtle, I appreciate you being here. Very hurt. Yeah, we don't want we don't want to set something up to hurt the channel. I mean, a weird flex could be used in a hurtful manner, but doesn't have to go in that direction. Okay, Scotty, thanks for the nine months. I appreciate it. Appreciate the support, nonetheless. Pants man, thanks for the seventeen months of Prime. We, you want the weird gun flex? All right, hey, like that. That's that's a good that's a good flex redemption. We're gonna. First thing we do, boots hit the ground, weird flex for Orin Emily. Good, good, good music change too for it. All right, let's go prop bet. I mean, we're gonna have to go into resort. We don't have to, but we're going to. Yeah, I got the, I got the flex. I'm really feeling it. Does this so this is this is Guar Plains from Xenoblade. When you hear this music in game, for those that have played Xenoblade, does it hit as hard as it does not? Yeah, let's go. Will we make it inside resort? That's a good prop bet. I'm really feeling it. Swammy swam. Plan. Okay, will we make it into resort with the quad? Look at that! It looks like a piece of Lego. You piece of Lego. Oh, that's a good gun to. There's your, there's your weird. Look at that. That's optimum gun flex because you're, you're getting your money's worth on the lasers. All right, let's get our money's worth here. How about a graphics card on the floor? Little Coca-Cola glance. Look at that laser. Thought I heard someone up here. Pepsi bottle. Coca-Cola glass. Ooh. Excuse me, Nikita. Trying to hold hold out on us there, Mr. Nikita. Look, honestly, that's pro this is probably the best laser formation we've ever had in the game. It's folded. 
tempered. I mean, without this on it, it's folded, tempered, and gets the job done. Look at that. You versus the laser she told you about. I really like it. I mean, like... That's OKL. That's our kind of lasers. But which laser is the bullet target? You already know. I mean, I feel like that... I don't, I feel like that mess is, eh, kind of looks like Space Invaders. Space, and Space Invaders. Catch the bullet for good luck. We're going to make that a flex, because I don't know how to do it. I have to do some research. I forget how to do it. Space Invaders. Key, key, key. No key. Base invaders. Are you on full auto? I certainly hope so. Certainly hope we're in full auto. Here. All right, let's go to resort. That's the prop bet. No, no, we... We should mark the tank on the way. The D tank, right? It's a nice looking gun, man. Is the D tank right or left from here? It's probably right, huh? Control R is the bullet catch. With, with no gun, with no clip, right, Brett? Okay. We call it, what do we call that? We'll call it, what, the weird catch? But that's a hard flex catch. Am I blurry? I shouldn't be blurry, Solus. Big payday, big payday, big payday, big. Yeah. Imagine getting a tank stuck. What do you do if that happens? I get out the jaws of life? Isn't Melf's grave the left here. Guy must have been fuming. <laughs> you know what? Let's go Heps. Let's go Heps. Hefeweizen. What is Hefeweizen? Hefeweizen is a German libation. They make recovery tanks. They make tanks to recover. People that crash a tank. Half a visor. You versus the laser she told you about? Sweep and clear, Sips. Sweep and clear. Okay, I got you. Head eyes. Head eyes in. <laughs> like ionized, but head eyes. Martin Kimi. I heard steps. Never forget. Where we got into a battle with Deadly. Half of Eisen key. Mm -hmm. 
It's a great loot spot. This is like Shoreline Streamer Room. Hoping we're gonna get some intel here. I hope we're gonna get some intel in the half of Vizen room. Intel? Oh. What is that? Shrimp silencer. That's mana, dude. Where does the stuff spawn? The intel? I thought that might have been intel. That's it, huh? On, on the cap cabinet, <clears throat> on the chair. Okay. There's gonna be something great in here. I'm telling you, something great's in there. You can feel it. You can feel it, it's great. This one? Great, greatness. Nothing in here, huh? We had to check it. Okay, let's get inside. One foot inside resort. Team Red gets a big payday. Come on. Gotta check his pockets. Gotta check him real quick. Check him. Check him. Check him. Check him. Check quick, 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 quick. Take it, bro. All right. It's probably a good shooter born in heaven spot right here. Should probably reload just for the memes. Fairly close, huh? What's up, Arrow Eagle? We got, we, we got a couple nades we could lob up there. Lob them. Lob them. I think that's inside or outside resort. I for inside, O for outside. Ninety-five Uber majority, because it's outside resort. Use the trees. Become one with the trees. The bark. Can you eat bark? Is there bark that's edible? I feel like in the movie Willow, Val Kilmer eats bark. Can you eat cinnamon like a stick? I just see it's for flavoring. Can you swallow bark? Trees in the edible inner bark. Wait, there's Inner and outer bark? I thought the bark was just on the outside. Layers of bark. I would try bark. I feel like it looks tasty. Like beef jerky. Is, is bark just plant jerky?
Arcus plant jerky. That's what you're here for. I mean, look. Tell me you, you take off a piece of bark. Tell me it's not plant jerky. Now that now that I know it's edible. The only time I ever saw someone eat bark was Mad Mardigan in the movie Willow. And then you gotta think there's probably gourmet bark. Bark is indigestible. All right, we're inside resort payout team red. Holy boosh. close to that corner man we're close to that corner oh that was a, was that a scav guard who did we get with the headshot oh the first guy player scav he looked he looked loaded to me that's why i backed down we should have went after him though in hindsight player scab yeah like i i saw all i saw was a huge backpack and i'm like but we were we, we were geared for that fight may have killed a player that would have been a good one to kill all right we got one more shot to finish this quest for sure um searching at i mean i was thinking about the scene where Mad Mardigan's chewing on bark. Uh, uh, probably not the time to do it when you step foot in resort. Did well, what, what do you mean by good zoning? You can pause fire to make think you're reloading. The inner wood of a sago palm is edible. When you mod a gun but run out of space, hit tab to move the gun. It. Controlling his own throwing the nade. Got it. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. Yeah, I felt like we played it okay. Uh, the first guy we killed was the guy outside power station. All right, so we're going to have to be quick on this one. And let's get rid of this armband. Um, let's go with the first gun that we have available. AKMS. Any lasers? One laser. We're good to go. Okay. We're just going to go budget build then. And then we have to head eyes. We've, we've gone through two sets here though. MP5 was insured. Yo, what's up, Rigabi? Yeah, we had a good battle. It was a good battle. Could have we we could have done different things, but that's that's what Tarkov is. You live and you learn. Um, speaking of, can we buy some gasoline? We can. Yeah, th for sure that that guy's taking that MP5. How could you not? I would take it. I would drop an RSAS for it. All right. Let's go. We wanted to go with this. And it's such a fun game. Even when you get bodied, I just wish we could get into the fun faster. 
You know that. You know what then we would be doing? I'm really feeling it. That was frame perfect. That's our first ever frame perfect. But well, I, I can't say it's frame perfect. That is, it was pretty close to frame perfect. We put that on there. Okay, we got good ammo. Red Ripper ammo. Uh, excuse me, Dan, that's Ram. And then, look, I know people are going to be mad we're bringing that with us, but you know what? Scared money. Drink a little hydration on Potation Tuesday. I mean, the only, uh, let's be honest, the only way we're going to win an engagement with this loadout is the head eyes. Happy Tuesday. Yo, Captain Snuggles, thanks for the bits. I appreciate the support. Happy Tuesday to you as well. Something, man, something about the, the TTS just hits a little different. You know, one thing we won't skimp on, though, we'll skimp on an armor, but we won't skimp on a backpack. scared money make money it doesn't i mean you know what fine you convinced me i've been convinced i've been convinced i have never played this game before do you restart from the previous obtained stash yeah so this is like this is like our home base welcome brand new subscriber and if you lose whatever you got at home you get to use again but whatever you lost in the raid or the map um you don't get it back but on the flip side you could take other people's stuff that's where it gets really interesting i mean we don't we got the monies how come these are cheaper? I thought the waffles were more expensive. It's not, some people say it's stealing others fun. I would highly debate that. Personally, that's me. I, I think we're, we're due for that. We're due, we're due for that. Um, That's very expensive. Why in chat if you think Tarkov is stealing others fun and in chat if no? Trading fund. I, I like that. I like that it's trading fund. Okay, we're good. Squammy. Squam, 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 squam. Okay, let's get this. Where's this third tank at? Is it on the other side of the map? We put some work in on this quest, I'll tell you that. Thank you guys for your patience. Part-time Dreadlord, thanks for the gift to King Dr. Pepper. Appreciate the support. Now nah, you play Tarkov, you know what you're getting into. You know what, TJ, man, that I like that. I like that. You know what you're signing up for. It's not like the it's not like the ground's pulled out from underneath you. It's sharing fun without asking. In the town by the tunnel. Is there a stash right by it? Let's Are other players it. stealing chat's fun when they kill Dan in game? That's very, very meta. Yo, Timber. Thanks for the nine months. I appreciate Let's it. Go. Mr. Ren, thanks for the three months of primacy. Ditch nerd. For the two space. Why? Can we get some damn pot? Enjoy <laughs> your bronze gummyicity. Thank you for the two years of support. I appreciate it. Let's, this is this is a complete no judgment zone. This is coming from someone who I really really no! enjoy watching. Hob, why in chat? It's no judgment. This is like the truest no judgment. Why in chat if you enjoy seeing us get bopped in Tarkov? And in chat if no. It help honestly. Your your Giannis re response helps me. <laughs> oh, 
Because it's not me. Depends on the hubris. Very much depends, but on average, no. 57% said no. So the other 43%. You firma banned. We gotta add, I'm gonna add this right now. It's, you know what chat? If you were part of the 43%, I, I know we said it's no judgment. But also. Twenty-four hour ban, permanent. <laughs> We're adding that to the soundboard right now. It's it's too good. It's too good. I, and I have to give. I mean, that is Happy Hob on Twitch, but I also have to give credit to Fan Tarina on the community Discord for for giving us that. I'm literally taking a moment while we're loading into our raid here, going into the proper channels, stream deck folder, live stream deck, 24 out, it's 24H underscore ban. Then we go over to this computer over here, we type in stream deck, load it up. Um, and there's an empty spot on the front board for it. That's a great spot for it. But this is this is front and center. This this is check, you know what I can show you. I could show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Front and center right there. That's where it's going. Forget about loading in. So where is it? Live stream deck. 24 hour ban. 24 hour ban. Permanent. There we go. That's so good. That's so good. <laughs> All right. All right. Um, we do have a laser. Good thing you're using the 2020 backup. Yeah, I don't know what that is. One of these days I'll get it all cleared up. <laughs> Where are we right now? No optic? Macros. The only optic we need is is the Twitch Prime dot of Icity right there. Sin victim meme meme? Playing Tarkov with an optic? Playing Tarkov with the laser. Yeah. Thought I saw someone right there. Fantarina, can we get some, uh, some, if you have it, hob weird at Fantarina for pulling this one? 24 hour ban. Permanent. good yeah i thought we saw other guy aside on the blue fence right he left or right here what's up flex i don't see him out there i see him now Here we go. Battle of the Ages. Squad of two. We can get him. 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 We gotta gain some ground on him though without. Okay, there's a team of two walking left to right up here. There are, there are, they're already up there. 
They just hopped the orange fence. Shoot, they were running. They're, they're already way ahead of us. There they are right there. See him? Right side. I don't know if we can get there. See him? They're right there. Cut him. Can we cut across? Right, we're we're going to have to cut across the power station, huh? We're assuming they're going to go power. I don't see him though, huh? You think they're going power? Sniper, shoot. Gave away our position, you jerk. We have to cross at gas because that's the only way to cross. We get him? Shoot. It's okay. Let's go to half a Vizen. Sweep and clear. Sweep and loot. Sweep and clear. I think you meant sweep and loot. We only had an optic. Right? All right, deadly slob corner here. Watch it. Half of eyes in room. All right. Weird. You don't feel comfortable with so few lasers. You and me both. You and me both. Keep them clear. Sweep an intel, please. The head eyes room. If you loot everything, the PMCs have no reason to come here. Gold. There's a scope for us. There's another scope for us. There's a suppy for us. There's another suppy for us. Something's right there, huh? We got our scope. Which one's the better scope? Holographic sight. EOTech is very bad. It's the only one that fits. That's not bad. The SRD is like 40k. Kind of nice, huh? This is a stormtrooper. That's awful. That's not bad. What's bad about it? it? Gives us some zoomies. Look at that. You're on top of the roof. Boom. Not anymore. Um, we need to go mark this other thing. That's money, dude. You wanted an optic? We got an optic. I 
a team of two is probably going resort, you would think. Why in chat if you like, if you're adequate, why in chat if you like this optic better than no optic and in chat if you just don't like this optic? Ninety-two percent like it. What's bad about it? I mean, look, it's it's not the best. Uh, I'll give you that. It's not the best. It doesn't have to be. This is what stormtroopers use. All right, you see their aim. They they got pretty good aim. Bruh. Behind us. At least you can see what you're shooting at. That's what I'm talking about. That's 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 talking about like someone who's been here for 31 months. Crimson Wolf. Next month, I'm still gonna say you've been here for 31 months. You ever get a sports jersey? It has 31 on it. We have 31, 31 vision. Keck Leo. Thirty-one month sub permanent. You go back in time the first month you sub thirty-one months. All right. Oh. Got to be smart here. Smart engagements. Smart movements. Smart watch, smart phone, smart thermostat. One ran behind us. Smart location. Headphones are not on backwards. Do you think they went? In one of the houses. Here we go. Hmm. He ran away.
little patience goes a long way. Little patience. Oh, CEO, we'll take it. We'll take it. We need it. We need it just a little something, something. Probably premium already looted. Were there two guys that we're about to find out? Tech Leo spam in chat. Right. Why in chat if you think Keck Leo is overrated and in chat if you think Keck Leo is underrated? My only problem with Keck is that it's 99% directed at the streamer, you know? Keck Leo? Not always. Keck Leo is like we're getting away with something. Let's repack here real quick. That's a good idea. Repack. What was the vote on Keck Leo? You see Keck W is the same as LUL. 62% think Keck Leo's underrated. That's why, like, I don't know, Keck W to me just hits a little different. Keck Leo. But Keck W, I think, gives you, like, a... Could, could give you a sour taste in your mouth. Sometimes you like the sour taste, right? Like that's why you eat Sour Patch Kids. But not every not every stream is Sour Patch Kids. We don't have this key, right? Sometimes it's on the blue barrel. We need this key. I don't look at it as attacking the streamer. I don't, I don't, I don't look at it like that, but it's definitely like when the streamer does something. Ooh. I just think Keck Leo, like the flex where the Keck is going. Um, we need to get to this wall here. Smart compass. Is this short? Which way is short line? This way. Your, your girlfriend is a sour patch snob. She'll check where the bag is from because each country uses a different type of sugar. Never heard of that. Warheads used to be bangers. There's this place where I grew up. Oh man, I can't think of it. It was something like something bulk foods. Something bulk foods, and you could go there and get like. The, oh, I see you.
um you could go get the most sourest gummy balls gummy gumballs of all time they're really good they had like a nice grain on the outside something bulk foods where's this guy at near the truck All right. Yeah, we spent a little too much time out there in the wild. And they would last like probably three minutes as opposed to like one minute. What is sour? Like if you were to describe what sour tastes like to someone that never had sour before, what would you say? Find another scab up here. sharp pace. Someone's up here. CEO Sour candies don't taste like sour Where they taste like sharp tang Sour tastes like vinegar What if you've never had vinegar? I feel like this other guy's got a red key card on him. This other scab. I don't know why, I just got that feeling. Somewhere down here. Red key card incoming. Red key card? And I, I saw I saw a key card like shape. Alright, that's what I saw. Alright, let's go get this other tank and get out of here. Am I a picky eater? No. There's just a f very, very few items that are on the do not eat list. You know what number one is on there. But I'll, I'll try anything for the most part. And chicken cordon blue. Look, I'm not sleeping on peas. We've gave it a fair shot. You saw the shot. We gave it its due day on the catwalk. I saw that that uh, last night. I saw that there was uh, in terms of Discord being bought out. Gas can. Here. Eating. A spoonful of peas on the show is the equivalent of wearing a helmet in Dark Souls and saying, chat, what do you think of it? That's the due day on the catwalk. Yeah, we're about due for a Discord poll. Canned peas are no good. Dan, you, you know I'm a connoisseur of cheese. If I tried the buffalo ones, I have not. Here's my thoughts on Cheez-Its. The only thing you can do is cook them a little bit different, right? So like you, you turn the heat up on Cheez-Its, that's, that's the best they are, but I don't think, I don't need any of the powder on my Cheez-Its. That's just me though. Like I've tried like the white cheddar ones. I pass on those. 
Keck, Keck Leo. Um, but if you're saying I'm, my my question for the flavor, if the flavor is just added powder, I mean I'll try it and take your word for it, but my optimism is is minimum. If the flavor is baked into the cracker, it's way better. You know what I mean? If it's just, just taking a cheese and putting some powder on it, no thank you. If it's baking the flavor into the batter, now we're talking. It's hot and spicy bacon. I don't know either. But if you're just putting dust on it, it's doing a disservice to the cheese. -it. You season and toss them on a smoker before. Now that's what I'm talking about. Hot and spicy is dust. Yo, what's up, Test? We had a poll, or we had a, it was a Twitter question when we were gone. What's the best part of Chex Mix? Yo, so I was around um, my brother-in-law this weekend. And I bought uh, a thing of goldfish. And he's like, are those flavor blasts? And I'm like, no. And then... I was around another cousin his same age, and I'm like, hey, you want some goldfish? And he goes, are those flavor blasted? I'm like, no. That was the first question. Like, I don't know if that's like a, a generational thing. But how about just good old-fashioned goldfish are good as they are? Not, I'm not saying that flavor blasts are not good, but I, like that was their first, like their first response wasn't, yeah, sure. It was like, are they flavor blasted? It's like, I don't know if there was some like good marketing done back then. Oh, we're looking for a tank here. Think a scav, maybe? Ready on Patoni. Yeah. Three, two, one. Head eyes. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> the CEO knows before they know. Tony, man, the lasers. That's a good key. Decent key. CEO flavor blasting. Tanker's like on the main road, right? Those bullets were flavor blasted. I don't know, like, I get it, you know, but I just feel like it, the mileage goes further if it's baked in the product as opposed to taking the product and just putting something on top of it. But also I understand that may not be economical. Change your entire batter. But you want to be taken seriously. You bake the batter. You don't, you don't dust the batter. Sweep and clear, sips, sips, sweep and clear. Sweep and clear. Sweep and clear. Resin, I can stay there. Maybe try flavor blasted peas. I want, you know what I made like dried peas, like air dried. You know, like you can eat um, like wasabi peas. Those are good. Like, I wonder if that translates. Dried peas. Oh, dude, I saw something. What did I have the other day? I had Spanish rice. And there were peas in it. And I'm like, is nothing sacred? You know? Like... 
if you're putting peas in your rice, that's telling me your the, your rice isn't very good. You, you need to you need to dress it up. Like the rice, if it's good, it stands on its own. CPU fan, that's worth taking. I mean, if you, like, here's my take on peas and rice. If you eat peas and rice, you're just eating mashed peas. That flavor's drawn out over additional receptacles. It adds something a little special. Sometimes you don't need it, man. It's as good as is. Go check the stash and we'll get out of here. They don't mash the peas in your, your rice. False. What do you think happens in your mouth when you put rice and peas? It just puts the pea flavoring all over the rice. You know what I mean? You eat your steaks mashed as well. If you eat a tomato, is it ketchup? No. Because there's other things in ketchup. Ooh. Dash cunning. Thanks for the tier two acidity. We get some tea space to spam in the chat. Thank you for the 17 months of tier 2 city. You know Dan eats his steaks well done. I prefer my steak medium. Medium well. Oh, that's a little, little pink. Dan, I'm from Spain. We don't put peas in our rice. Yo. Book me a, a ticket to España. I'm coming. Lord Beavington said peas are good actually. <laughs> Kid me? Lord Beavington? 24 hour ban. Permanent. In the north of the UK, there's a dish called Baby's Yed Pea Wet, which is a steak and kidney pie covered in pea juice. It's a delicacy. Not Red Dead? You permabanned. No, this, this, the scope was fuzzy for me. I couldn't see either. So now you're, so now you're telling me people are milking peas. Like they're turning it into liquid. I know, what the heck, I know, right? Ladies and gentlemen, reach in your back pocket. Spam the hard W. If you don't have the hard W, capital W suffices around these parts, we celebrate every victory. Five scavs. Equestorino. Jojo, I do like, um, I do like lentils. Lentils are good. Lentils are amazing. Yeah, we'll go prop bet. Is that new slim key? Prop bet. Is that new slim key worth at least 100k in the flea market? Denny the Frog, the real one. Brand new subscriber. 100% invented Denny's. Thanks for the support. Baloney Davenport, thanks for the 23 months of primicity. Says, I have no idea what Keck is, and I'm afraid to ask at this point. It's just a laughing emote face. 
Mr. Ren, thanks for the three months of Prime Timber. Thanks for the nine months. Appreciate the support, guys. It's a 50-50 bet. I mean, if you're putting pea milk on something, that something is lacking in flavor. That you need to, like, drown it in a worse flavor. That's just me, though. That's just me. Just me. All right. Let's, uh... Before we do anything egregious... Wait, didn't we buy a dog tag case? We did. It's nice to have. Um... Before we do anything, let's see if we can get rid of this Tetrino here. Would I eat peas if they were cooked by a professional chef? What I'd be willing to do as some sort of penalty, I would try another form of peas, but it would have to be some sort of a bet because I'm convinced I've had enough, personally. All right, let's step one. If sometimes you get overwhelmed by Tarkov, the loot system, get into a raid, just get everything out of your back pocket. If you looted it, just get rid of it. Um, who needs those knives? Rapper. I can't believe there's such a thing as pea milk. Turn those knives in. Thank you. Till cat. Kill 10 PMCs on shoreline. You must wear ba balaclava and scav vest. We could do that on our next one. Okay. Let's dump out everything else we looted. You looted it, you dump it. No questions asked. Donkey, donkey, donk. Okay. Next thing, we put some stuff on the flea market. Tech W. Put up for seventeen five ninety six. Price to move. Room one eighteen key. No thank you. Room three oh one key. Yes thank you. That was not our key that we needed. One five 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 nine six. We already have that key. That's a good pickup right there. Checkpoint's got to be forty k. Sixty four. I think we can sell that straight up if I remember correctly. BMD. No thank you. Bolts are good wood. 36,000. No, no, no. 35,596. Offer up a pipe and hot deal. Vulcan, worth anything? Yeah, we'll put it up. 25,596. But that's a, oddly, that was a really good raid for us. 46,000. No, no, no. 45,596. You probably. No, no, no. Probably picked up 200k in marketable securities there. Everything else, let's dump. Dump everything else, top top row. Donkey dunk. Yo, test story. Thanks for the submarine. A 100% invented maple story. Appreciate the support. Thanks for uh, hanging out and uh, deciding to support the show. I appreciate that. Test story, 100% invented Scantrons, by the way. We almost sold that. Why is that worth so much? All right, everything else we're just going to dump. If it's top line, we dump it or drink it. That was a profitable raid for us. Okay, last couple things here. Put this thing up, man. 66,000? No, no, no. 65,596. There we go. Cool. All right. Oh, we have this too. And then, look, we're not stalling. We are not stalling. Welcome, brand new on, subscriber. On the key thing. We're just cleaning up our inventory. Do we need this key? Oh, okay. We're not stalling. Oh. Keep that there for a second. Okay. Keck is worth something, right? 
19596. Okay, good. That was good. That was good. Let's do let's do one final dump here of this stuff. Go to mechanic, sell the rest. Sell the key, we're out. She won't buy the key, huh? She will. Sell peacekeeping the the digital drive. And we're good. Alright. Alright, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Let's collect our monies and then. So we have two million now. It's not bad, 2.3. Alright, cut the music, ladies and gentlemen. Time is now. The key is RBTB. Bruh. Sorry. I'm sorry. Wait, I'm sorry. I thought it was going to be a big one. Let's put all of our reserve keys in here because we never go there. Should we get rid of... Oh, there's... We have so many reserve keys. Why don't we ever go to reserve? Is there a reason why we don't go to reserve? Oh. What's the reason we don't go to reserve? Even have more reserve keys. Reserve is good wood. All right. Um, get some good raids, huh? We had some good raids today. Oh, excuse me. One final quest to turn in. Skier, maybe? Who likes that? Who likes this, uh, the tank stuff proper? Jaeger? Who, who likes the tanks? He's keepy. Ladies and gentlemen, load your craze in the chamber for the best sound in all of Escape from Tarkov. Eagle Eye. Man, we're making some progress this season, huh? We're making some progress. Where are we at overall here? 32,000 mastery. What's our most used gun? None. That's cool. Most leveled. SKS is our most leveled? We haven't used it. That's cool, the stuff's in the game. Uh, I think we're good. Let's, let's clear this out. Sell all this stuff. Uh, and we'll pop in real quick. We'll pop in on the hideout. You love hate nostalgia. Is there anything nostalgic that hits hard? Yeah, Ultima Online. Ultima Online, we always talk about that. But we're living in a new Ultima Online right now. All right, let's uh, let's sell these and then we should be right on time for Plattericity. Okay, check the hideout here. EverQuest is your, your Ultima. Respect it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's take a quick tour of the hideout. Got the Bitcoin farm pumping. Intel level two. 
I don't know you could make one of these. Should we make one? We can make one, right? 78 hours to make it? We should make it, right? Let's make it. It's an investment in our future. Where do you get that from? Reserve? This thing right here? Man. Okay. Making a graphics card there. Anything else we need to upgrade here? And when are you going to unlock the shooting range? Um, we have a lot of stuff to unlock here. Ooh, rest space ready to unlock. Three million. I wasn't part of the upgrade. No, we're not. We have like 2 million in Tarkov. We're doing pretty good. Uh, what we want to do is we want it. We want to get the scav box going. Let's be honest. We got to get the scav. It's, it's the ultimate loot box in Tarkov. How do we get that? How close are we to the scav case? Locked. Why is it locked? Seventy, seven hundred thousand for a roly. Three hundred thousand for a lion. You know what? I like to see. I love to see. I love to see that gold is finally properly valued in Tarkov. All right, I just, I just, I just got an idea. Yeah, I just got an idea. You guys tell me if, if you're down with the idea or not. Okay. Um, What about we do one last run? Scave speed run to the streamer room. Welcome, brand new subscriber. Can I get a YRN in chat, please? Right, let's get this. We're going to speed run it. Let's do it proper. say something else what's a what's a good speed run song chat we need a speed run song what's this a good speed run song mario kart Um, something we already have on the playlist. Rainbow Road. 
Do I have, yeah, we got a lot of Sonic. Okay. Oh, the splits aren't right. Okay. Here we go. Gotta get to the stream room quickly. Decent spawn for it. Actually, a really good spawn for it. 50,000 in the back pocket. I'm out of gas. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Sub 110 in the room. Sub 110 in the room, please. In. Oh, I thought there was someone right there. Loot, loot, loot. Quick, quick, quick. You. Hold chain. I feel like we should check. I feel like we should check the roller. Yeah, we got to check for roller. We're not done loot yet. We're off to check for roller. <gasps> Tetrino! Tetrino! Come on. Yo, Joel. Thanks for the host raid, man. I, I, I loved your, uh, your integration with, with, uh, with uh, Bo Ricks, the hair cutting place. Appreciate the host, man. Hope all is well. We're doing a little speed run here as our last raid in Escape from Tarkov. You're just coming in from Joel's channel. Welcome. I'm a fellow streamer from the, the, the great state of Michigan. Get on your feet wearing the Pistons red, white, and blue tonight. We gotta go. We gotta go. Too much loot. We gotta go. Okay, we gotta check Rolex. We'll add Rolex split, but we're not done looting. But if you're just coming in, welcome. Check the Roly. Also, there's a little welcome, brand new subscriber. Oh baby! Oh baby! Oh, that's the best loot in the game right there. Quick, 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 quick. Rolex, Rolex on the wrist. Okay, <gasps> double gold chain, city. What? Who do you think you are? We gotta go. We're, we gotta go. We gotta go. We're done looting. Done looting. Okay, where, uh, where's Old Road? Warehouse 17. Where's Old Road? Warehouse 17. Warehouse 17. We extracted there before. Where, uh, Warehouse 17's like Cuphead, right? Oh, baby. We gotta go. It. We're done looting. Now it's extract time. We got it. this is our best honest, our best loot in all of Tarkov right here. Tetrino, two gold chains. Who do you think you are? I am. I think we're gonna go. Um, where should we go? We're gonna go Cuphead, huh? Cuphead. Do we do we mix it up here? No, we work with our friends. That's really hard not to do it. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Donkey dunk, donkey dunk. up here to the right gotta watch it <laughs> the music's making it more mancus hang in hang in we gotta get out we gotta get out
Cuphead, baby. Warehouse 17. Okay, I know what it's it's in the it's corner corner one quarter quarter cuphead. Hang in here. We're okay. How's there? How are we doing on time? We're gonna get sub 730. We got a shot at sub 730. Run through doesn't matter. Run through doesn't matter. We want to run through. It means we've We've blown the doors off this run. Let me swam, swam, me swam. We're not checking Dunder. That's how you know we're going for speed. We're almost there. Them that need a cuphead. <gasps> it's a player. That's a player. Let them know who we're repping. Them that need a mini cuphead right there. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. We got to wait till we see the green or, or the... The run through. It doesn't count till we see the run through. Sub 630, sub 630, sub 630. Done. And. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. That's a great, great first speed run to the streamer room. <laughs> Two gold chains. Circuit board Tetrino LCD screen. 50,000 ruples. That's what we're talking about right there. A Trinitron. Tactical sport. Gas canister. You keep the backpack for good luck, ladies and gentlemen. If you were here for the first ever sub 630 speed run streamer room is city, I was here! Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point. <laughs> that was good, man. I like that. Yo, I'm just telling you, streamer, streamer room rush is the new Doom run. <laughs>